So welcome back to part four of our road trip. The place we're at at the moment is insane and I can't wait to get in there. It's one of Molly's bucket list locations she's always wanted to visit, so I'm so glad to be able to bring her here. But we are in Monaco, that's Monte Carlo. Let's get into this video. We've been walking into the main part of uh, Monte Carlo, just went past the Monte Carlo Casino, which is heaving, it's so busy. For some reason, my nose is running, and I've had a real bad eye. I don't know what's going on with my eye. We've just come down here to look at some yachts and that, and a completely different world down here. Absolutely insane. Just look at the views, mate. Yeah, it's lovely. <laughs> it's absolutely lovely. All the hard work, all the money, everything gone into building the van and this whole trip. Things like this make it worth it, you know? And all I to say is, if you want to do it, do it. It's, it's so silly not to. So Muddy just saw these and said, oh, look at that, it's me and Gary. That's funny as well. It's cool though. Now that is a rare sight, an F40 in this Ferrari dealership in Monte Carlo. Look at that.
So a little 30 minute drive down the road from Monaco. We're now in Nice. Let's go for a swim first. It's too hot. So we went down the beach, chilled out for a bit. It was so hot. And we're now gonna go for a walk around to the harbour port bit where all the yachts and that might be. Go have a look. But it's too hot, so we just chilled out. I don't know if we're going to go into town, we might just chill out here today and then head towards Cannes to be honest. I don't know, but you'll see. What a lovely view and beach. So, Nice is nice at the beach, really nice. We were so hot and tired in the last few days, we've had nothing but sun since like Annecy, then Geneva, well, Geneva was high actually, then Annecy was hot, then went to Turin, it was like 35. And then Monaco is like ridiculous, so we're absolutely tired and knackered. So we've just been chilling out today, getting our bearings back basically. It was nice here from what I've seen along the coast, but we drove through town early and a lot of the buildings around here do look a bit run down and a bit tired. I don't know if it stands out more, I notice it more now because we've been to Monaco. Monaco is crisp as hell. <laughs> Everything is absolutely mint. Everything's so well maintained. I don't know, but I can't complain about the beach. Just look at that. The water is so crisp and clear. It's absolutely lovely. But we might say tonight, we might not. We might go towards Cannes, head a bit further south. We do not know. But once we know, you'll know. So we'll see you soon. Now that is a flipping nice yacht. Boardwalk, it's huge. And it's got a helicopter on the back. I wish one day I could get me a bit of that, but let's be honest in all reality, that ain't never gonna happen. If anyone knows anyone with a yacht, wanna take me out on it, a little holiday, fucking hell, hook me up. Cause that would be amazing. Even those smaller ones, but like, I'd assure you as well. Mate, that's so cool. There's something about that upper class rich boy yacht thing I fucking love. <laughs> anyway, let's get back to the van and see where we go. I'm not sure where we are at the moment, but last night we went to the shop for some food and we found somewhere to park up using the Park for Night app and it gives us this location. And then we got here luckily, there's a fair few camper van and everything was quite busy, you could see fish and everything. But the showers on the beach, yeah, absolutely lovely. And you park on the beach. I think it's pronounced Antib or Antiba. But look at that. Lovely. And there's a fun tour over there. There's uh, like a water park somewhere. There's also like some sea life centre thing. Pretty nice place. Mm. This water is by far the clearest water I've ever seen in my life. It is literally like transparent. It's absolutely gorgeous. So as you can see, we are now in Cannes, and this place is lovely, like, it's incredible. There's a few yachts about, this place is lovely. But we also heard there's a skate park being built in Cannes, and online it said open for 2023, but it seems like they haven't finished building it yet. But it does look like a skate park, real nice bowls, a little cradle, it's a nice probably 12 foot, 14 foot wide spine, some sort of jump box fittings in the middle, but with loads of different hips off of it. Looks so good. It's really nice ball. Well, we can't ride it because it's not fucking finished. That's the Ah. Hey, well, it's sick though. Anyway, let's see what today entails. So 
So once again, we just popped to the beach today in Can and went for a swim and chilled out. It's so hot. We haven't really looked around town. And we didn't really look around town too much in Nice other than driving through it, and that's the same here. But we're now gonna head out of here and start heading back up through France as we need to get the ferry at the end of the week. And it's now Thursday, I think. Wednesday or Thursday, I don't actually know. So we've got 12 hours to cover over the next few days. So like, share and subscribe to this video. I just want to show you a few clips where we've been and the weather has been absolutely glorious. And uh, yeah, subscribe, comment. I'll see you in the next video. Ciao. <laughs>